So Mattel has apparently hired the creators of Team America World Police to make their new BTS dolls. And I got to tell you, mwah. <laughs> America, fuck yeah. What's up, everybody? Big Will, K-pop for life, coming back at you. And if you're not aware, Mattel announced like four or five months ago that they were going to be releasing a line of BTS collectors dolls. Um, I don't know if there's going to be like more of them after this. I'm sure it'll probably depend upon how well they sell. And you know they're going to sell well. But, but I don't think Mattel understood what they were getting into because I don't think they understand the mentality of some of the army. Now, me and me and the army, we've had our problems in the past. You know what I'm saying? We've had our problems. I got respect for a lot of them and I have disdain for others. <laughs> but uh, in this case, I'm, I'm kind of in the middle. I'm kind of in the middle on this one. So I'm going to put some of the pictures up here. I'm sure you've already seen them if you're watching this video, but I actually think that Mattel did a good job on most of the face. They all managed to pretty accurately capture facially each individual member. There's a couple of them that is kind of like, I don't know, you look like a stock Asian Barbie doll face, but most of them, you know exactly who they are right away. It's, it's the hair. It's the hair, man. And I'm bald, all right? So I, I know what I'm talking about because I'm envious as fuck of people that can still grow hair. And come on, Mattel. <laughs> Mattel, you're killing me. You're killing me, Mattel. The hair is so important when it comes to BTS. Even I know that. Come on, man. Half of them look like Tony Danza from Who's the Boss was the hair model. You know what I'm saying? Like half of y'all too young to even know what the fuck I'm talking about. But it looks awful. It's so bad. The hair just kills it. And there's a bunch of Photoshop edits out there where people have actually cropped the hair and put, you know, what it should look like on instantly fixes the doll because the faces are on point. It's just the hair, man. It's like, oh man, it looks like somebody took Donald Trump wigs and like dyed them different colors. <laughs> It just doesn't work. I'm telling you, tell me that the overall design though doesn't look like a Team America World Police. You know, every time, every as soon as I saw him pop up, I watched the YouTube video. We're like, we're happy to announce the the Mattel line, and first thing I heard was America, fuck yeah! There's not a lot to talk about here, right? This is another non-controversy. It's a fucking doll. Um, I think that people who were expecting like those one third or one six size like figurines that are like 900 bucks a piece and they're like hand sculpted by an artist. They look just like them. Those are out there. Um, I think people had expectations that were way over the top from what they were actually going to get. I mean, it's freaking Mattel. They mass produce these things. They have to be easily makeable. They're pumping them into an injection mold machine, squirting plastic into the dye the dye prints out a thousand of them at a time, goes down the assembly line, pops the hair in, pulls the clothes on, et cetera, et cetera. So I think people's expectations were a little bit uh, unrealistic from some of the things I've seen. And there's a lot of army that are totally fine with it. And everybody's like, I think it looks good. Like I'm going to buy them. And um, I, uh, I would have to say though, if, if, if we're picking which one looks the best, Immediately, right off the top, Jimin. Jimin's lips and his hair, because he's got that big poofy hair. Like, his hair looks okay. Um, I would say Jimin looks the best, because his lips are spot on. Ratman looks good. He's got the dimple. And uh, even J-Hope, they kind of nailed this smile. He's got, like, a bigger smile. And uh, it, they, it looks like him. Like, it just, that hair, man. That hair. They, the Team America World Police Donald Trumped them. I don't know. <laughs> I don't, I don't know how else to say it. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And don't forget to hit subscribe and the like button. And as always, keep on popping, K-poppers. Remember, it's not a trend.
It's a lifestyle. Deuces.